Right, CBS 8's Regina Urita spent the day at the fair playing some of the games. She joins us live from the county fair to tell us which games give you the best chance of winning and which one will send you home empty-handed. And Regina, I don't see any big, you know, stuffed animals, goldfish. I, I don't, I don't see any of that in your hand. So, how'd you do? Oh wait, how'd you do out there? <laughs> exploring all the games the fair has to offer and all the prizes like this huge purple slot that would look beautiful in my kitchen but let me tell you playing these games and winning these prizes is not that easy at least if you're an average player like me but you know I spent like my entire morning playing these games I got 16 tickets they cost me 20 bucks and I think I did pretty well but you can be the judge of that So the first stop is getting tickets. I got 16 tickets, which were 20 bucks, but if you want 50 tickets, it's going to cost you 50 bucks. It's the ring bubble game. After you get your tickets, it's time to get your game face on and look for the game that seems easy to play. But most importantly, that won't eat up your tickets. I only purchased 16 tickets to use, and I was able to find a game called Bank a Ball that only needed four tickets. So let's start with one ball. Let's see how I do, and then we can go from there. I failed this game, and because I was down to 12 tickets, I needed a strategy. It was time to ask families what's an easy game and the best strategy to win a game. How many times did you guys have to play to get the bear? It was only one basket, six tickets, and I think it it was like on the 15 toss that we won it. So we just happened to be lucky. This family says they want a large stuffed bear by luck. They played the ring toss, one of the easier games to play. It consists of tossing a ring and making it land over the mouth and neck of one of the bottles. Knowing this game has 16 tries and only needs six tickets, I decided to give it a try. You win on luck? Is it pure luck? Yes, any luck, only luck. After 23 tries, I left this station with no luck, no prize, and only six tickets in my pocket. I have no luck. Since that didn't work, I went to the main source, the employees helping visitors win a prize. I stopped at a game called Bottle Up that took my last six tickets. The man working the station showed me how easy the average person can win this game. All you need to do is follow his strategy. I played five games which cost me $50, but some people told me they spent 100 bucks. After failing at almost all the games and even witnessing a toddler win a stuffed Pikachu and not being able to win a large pig myself, I learned several things. You can't win all the games. The easier games are the ones that offer several attempts. Families say the basketball game is one of the hard ones. And most importantly, start with the games that require less tickets. might want to talk to you. That was a nice throw. I think I've gotten better. <laughs> but no, you're not coming home with any big stuffed animals. Though. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Richie.